Hopefully the Democrats can come through with a, a better candidate. I heard maybe you are interested. Is that true? Any truth well, I'm, to that? I'm seriously considering it. I mean, I've traveled to 15 states over the last few months. I've raised money for Democrats. I've been active in getting out the vote for Democrats in connection with the midterms. I'm seriously considering running in 2020 because I think this is a unique uh, moment in our history. I think there's a lot at stake, and I don't believe that a typical politician is going to be able to beat Donald Trump in 2020. How do you think it's gone so far? Even though they threw out the case, do you think you've still made some strides forward? Well, they only threw out a very minor part of the case. Okay. I mean, there's, there's the most significant case, the NDA case continues. There's another case that's also continuing. So really, they only, uh, they only tossed out one claim. We've appealed that claim. So okay. it's far from any significant loss to my client or to me, despite the fact that Donald Trump wants to try to claim otherwise. What did you think about Melania's interview when she said she doesn't believe that her husband has been disloyal? You know, I mean, I think that she has her own reality, I guess, that she has come to uh, believe. Uh, I don't know what he has told her or convinced her of. You know, people very often want to believe uh, or believe what they want to believe. And I think that, you know, women especially are starting to realize on, on both sides, not just on the left, but also on the right, I think that they are starting to come to the realization that uh, Donald Trump is a misogynist, uh, does not like women, does not like women in power, does not especially like women that speak truth to power. And I think Donald Trump is going to have a significant problem, as he should, with women on a go-forward basis. One more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.